In the gospel text of today, we will hear about the healing of a paralytic. This is really a pronouncement story and a miracle story. The pronouncement is about the authority which Jesus has over sin and over every kind of ailment. Matthew deliberately has Jesus forgive the man's sins before healing him physically in order to indicate that Jesus has authority and power over both the spiritual realm and the physical realm. Jesus has authority to forgive the sins which we commit with our minds and with our hearts and with our actions. And he also has the authority to heal us of our own paralysis. Doctors today are convinced that there is an intimate connection between what we call the internal and the external and they refer to them as psychosomatic illnesses. The word CUK translated in English as the soul actually refers to the inside of a person and soma refers to the body. So CUK and soma. If my mind is affected, if my heart is affected, if my insight is affected, it will tell on my body. So illnesses like fistula, like piles, like stress diabetes, like hypertension, like high blood pressure, even heart attacks and cancer today can be caused by the negative emotions in my heart. And one of the most of these negative emotions is the emotion of unforgiveness. If I keep that resentment in my heart, if I keep that bitterness in my heart, if I keep that anger and jealousy in my heart and I'm unable to let it go, it is very likely that I will not enjoy the best of health. Today then is a challenge to ask ourselves whether we want to let go of all of these negative emotions, especially that of unforgiveness and so be free. The Lord is inviting us to this. What is our response to him?